유난히 뜨거웠던 지난 여름과 내 손을 잡아줬던 너의 미소 이제 다시는 다시는 볼수 없지만 다시는 Hey guys, so welcome back. I am back with another DIY for you guys, K-pop DIY. So this DIY is going to be basically room decor slash clothing. I was supposed to do like a fall room decor video like months ago, but I never had the time to do so, so I'm guessing this is going to be my fall room decor video. I don't even know. I have some ideas for you guys that are perfect for this really cold weather. So I made some sweaters for you guys, like give you guys some ideas as to what you can do. And I also made some room decor as well. So definitely check that out. But this is also a collab with my good friend Robin or the K-pop 101 here on YouTube. She's also going to be doing some K-pop DIY room decor and some other ideas as well. So make sure to check out her video. I will leave it in the description box below. So yeah, and I think we should just get straight on into the video. But yeah, let's do it. It's like, okay, all right. <laughs> so the first DIY is going to be a sweater. So for this, you are You're going to be needing some black fabric paint, some sponges, and a sweater of your choice. So I was inspired by my blood, sweat, and tears phone case. If you haven't seen that DIY, I will leave it in the description box below. But basically, I'm using the same stencils and letters for this sweater and just made them bigger. And I cut them out and then I used an X-Acto knife to cut out the letters and then went ahead and just used my fabric paint and went over it. So yeah. So if you don't want to have any of these blots or like anything ruined, you can go ahead and just use some freezer paper and just iron it onto the fabric and then go ahead and do the painting process from there. But I didn't have any with me so I decided not to use it so yeah. <laughs> And this was sort of a struggle to do because I didn't let the letters dry in between so I was like scared that it might go on to like the other parts of the, sh of the jacket so yeah. But now I'm going to the front of the jacket and I decided to put BTS's logo onto the pocket or there's no pocket but <laughs> basically around the pocket area and this is how it should look like and so yeah. <laughs> So for the next DIY, you're going to be needing a sponge brush, some acrylic paint, 
some marker of your choice, E6000 glue, some clips, and a wooden circle. And I got my wooden circle at Hobby Lobby, and it's a huge one, so yeah. And now basically, I'm using my acrylic paint to paint it white, and it will take a few coats for it to be fully opaque, but yeah. So once that is done and you let it dry, I went ahead and took my gold permanent marker and decided to write something over it. So I was thinking of many ways of what I can do with this because this was all last minute. But I decided to write fall in love and I really liked how it looks. And I know I didn't get to do a fall room decor video so this might just be the video where I do it. But anyways, this is how it should look like and it just looks really cute and I did not expect it to look cute at all. I thought it was going to be a fail, but it ended up looking okay. And now as you can see here, I decided why not draw a feather on it just to add like the fall vibe or winter vibe onto it. And so I just decided to draw that and added a few more things and yeah. Now for the gold clips, which I also got at Hobby Lobby, I'm going to be using the E6000 glue and gluing them onto there, and I will basically be using this, as I said, wall decor or room decor and putting some Polaroids or just some memories on there, and it just looks really cute. So the last DIY I think is going to be really easy, so you're just going to be needing some images of your choice that are printed onto sticker paper, and I will leave the link to where you can buy some sticker paper in the description box below. But as you can see, I am using these little BTS stickers that I made myself, and decided to put them around the cup like so, and I made I cropped them into circles, and I just made it go all around, and it surprisingly it fit. So yeah, and this is how it should look like, and you can use this as like a candle hoarder, ho holder, and it's so cute. <laughs> guys so that is the end of the DIY I hope that you guys enjoyed these ideas and I hope that you guys will recreate it and if you do please tag me on your social media I would love to see your guys as beautiful recreations and yeah also make sure to check out Robin's video like I said I will leave it in the description box below also follow me on my social media and if you guys haven't known already I am part of a collab channel with a bunch of great other k-pop youtubers so seven days of Stan and I will leave that channel in the description box below I already uploaded a video and I upload every Wednesday on that channel so make sure to check it out but yeah that is the end of the video guys and I'll see you in the next Next one. Bye! <laughs>